Good morning, my crafty lovelies. I'm back again. Come craft with me. <laughs> We're doing our mini doily book. I've got it laid out here at the moment. And I've decided I'm going to work on this page here. I'm going to make it my second page. So that will go in there. Um, oh, hang on. No, it's not the second page. It's the third page. I think it goes like that. Right, so I have taken my main lace out of the Lilac Memories kit and I've cut out a flower. I hope you can all see that, make sure I'm in the, in the camera and I'm going to pop that on there. So. Here's my little handy dandy spatula head. Because I can't afford one of those U Butte fancy glue ones. These work just as well. The silicon mat that I used to have, well, I do have, I'm not sure where it is, is actually a baking silicon mat. And I don't know where you are, but where we are, I can pick them up from uh, the cheap shop for about three dollars. And I've got about three of them. And do you think I can find one of them? Hmm, not at the moment. So when I can't find it, I usually have a piece of baking paper in here. And it works just as well. So I'll put that on there. Oh, where are we? There we are. Let me just adjust my camera a little bit. That looks a little bit better. Yes, the camera is on. You said you weren't coming back in the room. Goodbye. Thank you very much. My housemate. Ah, he likes to come in and update me on everything that's going on with Trump. <laughs> no, he's not a Trump fan, I, I'm afraid. Neither am I. But anyway. So I'm going to put this down here. I should have still down. This is just the top of this lace here. And I've just cut it into little shreds so that it's a dangle. I'm going to pop that under there like that and cover that up. Right. There's my little dangles. Like that. And I've decided on this page I want to put my Passport and camera. So I'll just pop them in there. That's this other passport because we've got one on another page somewhere. And because I've got all the flashy sparkles on here, I thought the camera would go good. I don't know. That's my theory anyway. Uh, pop that there. I'm just going to take a couple of my little sparkles here. And I'm going to put them in the centre of these flowers. And even though they've got glue, uh, they've got a sticky on the back. I like to use a bit of glue because the sticky seems to, after it's been there for a while, 
and it moves around it tends to come off so I'll put that on there that's kind of what I want to do with that for now um, I might use a little bit of that so when I gathered up this lace earlier for the other page and did that in the centre um, let's see on this page here I actually trimmed this off here I think I might just go around the edge with that around that edge there so let me get that out of the way few little pleats in it so that it actually goes around the corner. I'll probably put it around the wrong way but anyway probably would look nicer the other way. Ah oh, no I don't like it. See now that I've decided I wanted it the other way I don't like it so that's coming off. It's going the other way. <laughs> Just because I have to. <laughs> All right. Yes, I like that better. Just didn't want that straight edge on the on the outside. Isn't it amazing? You can sit here alone by yourself all day, and the minute you start recording, people want you. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have a lock on my door. So, yeah, I kind of like that. Just push those down a bit. Yeah, I like that. That's easy. So, that will be the next page. Lovely. Yeah, so we've got our passport there and the suitcase. And then the next page we've got a passport and we've got our camera. And that will be laced up on that side there. I hope I'm not talking too quietly. Now I've taken these pages here and I've just put a clip on them so that I don't have to keep checking which way it sits because when they're like that it's a bit hard to tell. So that's that's going to be our last page there with the car on it. And that will be the page that goes there. The smile there, so I've got to decide what I'm going to put on these two pages. Uh, let's see, I've still got plenty of laces left. I wonder if I want to just go through the middle, maybe. I might do that.
Oh, you've been fun, Mott. Just overlap that like that. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut that across to that skull up there. I'm going to bring that round like that. I like that, I like that. And I'll do the same there. Some glue across there like that and down through the middle here Just gonna fold that round like that. So it goes around just a little, little bit there. Yeah. Yeah, let's see, I might do that on the top too if I can. Just to frame it a little bit more. Not completely make it round, but. Just brings that lace edge in and around. Oh, he's found a way to stay out of my hair. He's taking the puppy dogs for a walk. I'll appreciate that. It was so wet yesterday, there was no way they could go for a walk. They do like their walks. And that's my little girl you can hear in the background. Very excited. Now, whether he can get out the door or not with the two of them, that's another story. Normally, I have to help him. <laughs> there we go. That's good. Just to hold that in place. Ah. I can't. I don't know if you can see that, but it just brings that scallop sort of around, which I like. I like. I like. It's not all the way around, but that's okay. I can live with that. Scraps. Yes, now I have to sort of decide what I'm going to put on that page. I don't know. Let's see what have I got left. I've got a map, I've got a ticket, I've got two sets of sunglasses. I thought I only had one. Okay, well, that's all right. So we've got a map, a ticket, and two sets of glasses. Uh, oh, and the word fun. Oh, the word fun. So, fun. Oh, I like that. Yes, 
I do actually. So I'm going to put my ticket down here like that. World ticket. Wow. Let's go around the world. Let's have a little bow at the top, I think. Yes. Yes. That would be good. Ah, lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Now we're going to have our fun just there. Let's have fun. Woohoo. And a set of glasses down here. Lovely. Well, you got to take your sunnies on your trip around the world. Well, and let's see. I might use some of this as a dangle. Fold that in three. Like that. Let's see. One, two, three. sunglasses. Oh, I hope you can hear me. I'm sort of mumbling away to myself here. And I've got the little centre out of the flowers here from when I cut them around. I'm going to pop that on top of there and I'm going to put a little sparkle there. I think. Like that. Let's see, shall I put one of my buttons in there? It's a bit big, I think. Use one of these sparkles. A little bit of glue. And there we go. That's quite nice. I kind of like that. Hmm. So I'm going to leave that like that for now. I'm going to go on to this one. Let's see. 18 minutes, so I think we can probably finish this. Um, Hmm, what am I going to do with this one? Let's see. Yes, this is ever so soft, this lace. I'm going to take it there, like that. And gather that a little bit at the top just to give it a bit of a bit of dimension let's see like that. rather than having it just flat on the top it gives it a, 
little bit of ruffle through the page. Because I want to keep that little ruffle a bit there, like that, and again like that. So, where the ruffle touches the page, I've just glued it a little bit because I want to try and lead this up like that. Oh, and the magpies are singing this morning. There we go. So it's just got a little bit of dimension there. Now, oh, let's see if I've got any little bows left. I do have a little bow left. Look at that. So I'm going to put that at the top. Um, let's see, do I want anything else at the top as well? A little bit of this left. So this is just a bit of that top again. I'm going to have that hanging down. Again, I'm going to do my threes. don't know what it is. Uneven numbers seem to work better. It looks more natural than a, if I had two. So I'm going to have three there, like that. I'll put them at the top. Just so they hang down. I'll pin that one over that way a little bit. It's a bit fat to me, but anyway, twist it around a bit, I think. That's better. So like that. Sorry, I hope I'm not moving around too much. And I'm going to put my little bow at the top. Like that. Oh, that noisy truck outside is my bin man this morning. Oh, I like that. that. That's pretty. So, we've got our map and our sunglasses left. So, how are we going to put them on there? I think I'm going to use those as some tassels on this page. I'm going to roll them like that. And we'll just hide them under here. Just under there, make sure that they're all attached. Lovely. I'm just going to snip that corner off. I don't know, straight corners just don't do it for me. There we go. Oh, that's better. Now, I've just got to put my sunglasses and my map on. Let's see. I think the map can go down the bottom there. And the sunglasses can go up the top so that you're looking at the map. Yes, let's do that. That sounds cool. So just in the crease there. There's our map. Over there, I'm gonna put my sunglasses. I wear my sunglasses at night. <laughs> right. So let's see. That looks pretty cool. I kind of like that. Okay, 
I think I'm going to call that done. So I'm going to thread these up. Start with my back one. Where's my tweezers? Too easy. Use the tweezers. Oh, come on. I hope if I didn't have a big lump of glue on my finger. <laughs> so from there. And it makes it a lot easier just using, like, doing your ribbon last. I mean, it helped when you're doing the pages like that. But like I said, I put a clip on it. But um, by lacing it up last, then you know how thick your book is going to be. So... And I always tend to go through and add a few little bits more once the book is together. And so, oh, it would have been nice if I remembered to put those flowers on like that. Because I was going to add them, wasn't I? Let's just add them there. <laughs> well, might, might as well put a little sparkle on the top. It's, been as, it's got a flower right there. That would look nice, wouldn't it? Done is never done. <laughs> Until it's overdone. Right, and the last page. Through. It's clever, I threaded it through and then dropped it out again. There we go. So, let's see. Leave it about that long. Tie that up, not too tight. And do a double knot there. Just pull it a little bit like that. And then I'm going to do a bow. And I'm going to double knot that one as well. Like that. And I'm going to cut this 
down like that. So that will add to my dangles. Yep. And I think that's pretty neat. Yeah, that was pretty good. Do I have any more of that one left over? I don't think I did, no. Never mind. I could always cut a little piece of this off again and add that to the dangles here. And we've still got quite a bit of our purple kit left, our lilac memories. Um, and we've got some little flowers left. And we've got some buttons left. So that was, and we've also got those left. So that was our three kits, um, our button kit, our lilac memories, and our doily kit and we've still got enough doilies there to do something else um, what I might do is actually get the scrap bucket out and do a tiny one <laughs> okay so that's that's our book that's our first page and the second page third and fourth obviously there you go the last two pages and the back so thank you for joining me I hope that inspired you ladies and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.